one, identify each half reaction below as either oxidation or reduction. And then we have the balanced equation, Cr, so chromium metal, which will yield into Cr3 plus plus three electrons. E negative is always electrons. Now, whenever you're talking about oxidation, reduction, right, reduction, oxidation, or redox, R-E-D-O-X is the combination of oxidation and reduction, always think of the mnemonic, Leo the lion says grr. So we have L-E-O and G-E-R. LEO stands for lose electrons. Anytime that something loses electrons, that's oxidation. So lose electrons oxidation. On the flip side, if you gain electrons, that's reduction. So it's this idea whether you're losing the electrons or gaining them. Now in this case, since they gave us an equation, all you have to do is just look at where those electrons are located. Electrons are either going to be on the left side of an, an equation or on the right side. If they're on the right side, as in this equation, that means that you're losing them, right? Anything that's on the product side is always like what you produce out, right? And for electrons, you lost them. So anytime that you see electrons on the product side, that's oxidation. On the flip side, if you did see the electrons on the left side of the equation, that's reduction. So since these electrons are on the product side, they're on the right, this is oxidation. And that's it. That means that this chromium is going to lose electrons because it's undergoing oxidation. And it's as simple as that. So there is the answer. And we are done. What do you think? Thank you so much for viewing the video. I hope this helped. Let me know in the comments. Subscribe to the channel if you want to help us out. And I hope you all having a great day out there. Let's keep studying hard. Good luck on your tests. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.